Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here with Noli, and welcome to Freezing Extension. Now, if you guys don't, if you guys aren't like familiar with the anime, it is quite um, it's quite good to be honest. I I enjoyed it at least. I mean, there is a little bit of etchy and stuff going in there, so yeah, if you don't like that kind of stuff, then probably not the best thing for you. There is harem as well. It was back when when I was like really into harems and a little bit of etchy because they were like hilarious to me <laughs> they still are there just hasn't been any like really good ones from like all the way back then but let's see we got four different classes we got all-rounder we got finisher we got decoy and we have striker hmm finisher so looking at their stats I don't know which one is better. <laughs> right, I'm just going to go with uh, the one I like the most. The thicker one. What? Anywho, let's just go in and uh, see how the game is. <laughs> so this is another different language game. And it is Japanese. Ah, oh, Satellizer. I think that's her name, right? I believe it's Satellizer. I haven't watched the anime in like so freaking long, so if I do butcher any of the characters' names or forget who they are, then uh, my bad. Oh, is this the summoning? Oh. Do not know who she is. So I'm guessing there are a few random characters among like the actual main characters in the game which I wouldn't doubt okay. so from what I know this is like a turn-based game also that's just from what I know. Uh, you know what? Oh my god. Look look at the RAM, guys. Huh. You know what? Just for you guys, I'm going to sit here and download the HD. And I will be right back with you guys once it's done. Alright, so everything's just got done downloading. And we're going to get into it. Oh my. Um, so automatically it gives like the whole... Uh, Destiny Child <laughs> scenes from like the start of their menu. We can click on the character. I'm pretty sure a lot of Destiny Child's uh, screens are clickable. And the characters move. So I wonder how they're going to portray everything. Developed by Trinity Games. Oh, we can't really click anything here anyway. Oh yeah, they were fighting Novas, that's what it was. Alright, let's go ahead and skip and get a little bit further in. Where's my music on the loaded screen? This is weird. <laughs> Have you noticed a lot of games do that? Like, random moments they would have, like, no music at all. In other moments they would just like, yeah, we're going to play as much music as we can. Then they just make it awkward afterwards. <laughs> Alright, here we go. So we got Kim here. Okay, I see. It's kind of like a... Um, what was it? Brave Frontier. Where you just click the characters. Yeah, it's basically like Brave Frontier. I guess just swipe down for this skill. I was about to say, I don't really think skills are necessary for the last one. 
So we got freezing points here. God, I haven't... I haven't kept up with anime in like a long time. I don't even remember what... What is what? Oh god, this is our boss. This thing's about to wreck us. <laughs> Just her happy face. What if you can actually kill this thing? Oh. Well, this game also has the whole stripping <laughs> function. That's, that's good to know. <laughs> so if you have to take a certain amount of damage, they uh, get stripped. Let's say I guess she's gonna carry the team. Oh, she was gonna carry the team. God, I need to go back and watch this because I I definitely don't remember a lot of it. She's watching this just makes me just makes me feel like this is a new anime to me just because I haven't seen it in so long. Alright, we're gonna skip that. Alright, let's hurry up and get past this. Is this an auto? Uh, yeah, that's the auto sword button. I figured. Alright, let's get into the story. Actually, I kind of like this character. <laughs> Super edgy. But it's kind of funny because most of the characters in the anime would also get like their clothes shredded and stuff like that. I, I don't think they were in their full on like panties and stuff. I think they were just fighting with like ripped clothes. <laughs> But apparently in this one, uh, well, maybe I'm wrong. I, I, like I said, I haven't watched it in a long time. I, I, I could be wrong. But I feel like they were definitely not. So basically, once your armor's ripped off, your character goes into this state. I'm pretty sure they take bonus damage, too. Well, obviously they take more damage if you break out the armor, now that I think about it. Obviously they got the whole elemental thing. So decoy is technically just tank. Finisher is pretty much attacker. I guess striker is DPS and all around is just basically a hybrid. Oh, I didn't think we killed the one in the back. What the hell? Obviously, we got our character in the very back. Oh, so this is auto. All right, go for it. <laughs> that was quick. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention the bosses can get stripped too if they're female. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> I actually kind of like that. I mean, not bad for a chibi style model game.
I don't know if I can get behind this game though. I'm gonna have to have something definitely worth my wow. Like I said, I gotta get through pretty much at least most of the game to see if I actually want to continue playing it. So I'm gonna wait until the end of the video just to get my actual opinion of the game. Okay, this is the news, I'm guessing. Yep. What's in here? My mailbox though. Oh. I got some more rewards. Oh, they got a Halloween event going on. Oh my god, so many things. Alright, what's in the mailbox? Oh, dear god. Um, a lot of things actually. Ooh. Food. I don't know why that food reminds me like of... What was it? Like those little ODS games where you like give food to different characters and gain affection. Like, um... You get a tag. I think it was like tag team? Tag match? No, it was tag force. That's what it was. Hey, she looks pretty cool. She looks... Is she basically a doctor? Is that what I'm getting at? So this is gear, right? Yes, it is. And this is our first five-star ticket. What are we going to get? Definitely not a character I've seen before. Alright, so now we got some lower end stuff. Well, it's purple, so it probably could be good. Well, nah, never mind. Uh, I saw it pop up as purple. I was just like, eh, it's probably purple, so it's probably good, right? But no, that's just effective. Just popping it up. It actually is based on stars. What's this? Uh, little pieces of fragments. Guessing that's for leveling up the character. Alright, so this is my team. Let's go ahead and auto put them up. There we go. Save that. So is there anything else we can do with the character? Let's see. So this right here looks like evolving. Okay, yeah. So we ta we tap on them, they pretty much tell you what they are. Uh, this is limit breaking. This is leveling. This is enhancing skills, which it looks like you can enhance skill with goad. Yeah, you enhance skills with goad. Yeah, that's nice. Instead of getting duplicates, that's really nice. And this is... This is all basically putting them in the team. It goes to armor and stuff that we can put on. I wonder, is there an auto put on or anything? No? Okay, there it is. <laughs> there actually was. And obviously you can put them on your favorites. And they have a 3D model look too. I want to see what she looks like. Alright, let's see. Yeah, she looks pretty nice. This is the other teacher we just got. Well, not teacher, uh, doctor. I mean, either one.
Oh, wait, hold on. Do I have any gears for you? Okay, we got, like, a few. Just making sure. Alright, let's see if we can find the summonings. Oh, this is just a normal shop. Let's see what they got. They got stamina right here. They got gold right there. I have no idea what the hell those are. These are like little fragments that you can buy. Noted? What's this? Ah, here's the summoning. So this is the step up system? I think we're gonna do the step up, if anything. We're just gonna get our free summon out of the way. What we get? Is that a lance or a drill? Okay, no, nah, I'm good. I was afraid to click which, whichever one. I always like summoning in videos. It's always so much fun. Just seeing what you get. Alright, we got something that wasn't too bad. Alright, let's go to the step up and see what we get. First step. Obviously, we're going to get one. Alright, now we're going to get two out of the next one. Oh, we have some yellow ones. Hmm. Kinda like her. That weapon looks familiar. For sure. Alright, so now we're in step three, which seems like it has a higher chance of getting five star. Alright, seems like we just got rares. Okay, I feel like I remember this character. Okay, duplicates. <laughs> what do we do with duplicates? I like Ghost with Freckles. Anywho, uh, let's continue on. So if we do this, we're going to have to gain points for this. Just for the final milestone. But uh, let's go. Let's see what we get. Okay, we got two um, yellow ones. How's this shit again? How's her? Alright, I have a five star of you. Okay, I definitely feel like I know her. It's funny because you can't, after a while, you can't really tell which character was who is out of the anime. Especially after not watching watching it for so long. God, we have a lot of gold now. What's this? Oh, it seems like some little uh, gems that we can throw on characters. Excuse me. Probably enhances like stats. Nice. All right.
I have no idea what these things are. So we are the game to rest. Okay, so apparently we fix well we finish some things here. Go ahead and collect our rewards. Actually, we probably could uh, do the last step. If anything, I'll put the last step at the end of the video if I actually do get it. What else is this book? Is this like dailies? Yep, this is like dailies and uh, missions. How many do you get out of this? Is that... I think that's 30. Alright, so we just leveled up. Level 2. Alright, no more of those. And we just leveled up again, I'm pretty sure. Oh, nope, not yet. There we go. No, I, I'm stuck. No, don't ever do that. Okay, cool. I was about to say, please don't ever do that. That does not help. I hate games that do that. It's like, oh, you leveled up. Hey, click this. It's like, dude, no, fuck off. <laughs> please. So now, I'm guessing this is the affection sim? Yeah, I'm guessing this is the affection scene. To where you can change their appearance. You can have a conversation, but you would have to choose the right one. I just chose one of them. I, I don't know, I just guessed. Apparently, I'm a smooth talker. <laughs> Alright, what's up? Oh, okay, so this is like little skills for my main character. So you're saying my characters don't do special abilities? Alright, thanks for that little information. I want to go back here and get my rewards though. Last one. At least I think that's the last one. Oh. We leveled again. Alright, yeah, that's the last one. What's this? Oh, is this like a daily goal thing? Well, not like daily goal. Uh, like a weekly goal thing. To where you do all these like challenges for a week. And on each day, pretty much looks like it's six days. So the first day you want to complete all these. Then the second day you complete all these. Then you get 100% and you get this much. Yeah, I've seen those before. A lot of games, actually. Okay, it's just telling us that we have new gears. Uh, this is just like our inventory, right? A weapon inventory. We grab this gold. And the first thing I want to do is go in here and enhance this character's um, skills again. I wonder, does this take me to her actual screen? Okay, yeah, it does. Uh, this skills. Oh, so she has to be six star. Okay, so it only goes up to whatever level. Well, whatever star your character's on. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Okay, 
It does cost a lot of gold, though. Oh, wait, also, hold up. I wanted to see what those little other characters were. Uh, evolving characters? Okay, no, that's level up. Oh, these are definitely XP. These, I think... Yeah, they're definitely XP mons. Because I don't think you could use them in an Evolve, can you? Okay, no, they're XP mons. Noted. I was about to say, is there a skip? Because <laughs> that's going to be a lot. And we got a lot of HP too. Jeez. That was this. Oh, just that stuff. Alright, let's go on some missions. And try our new characters. That will just one shot everything, basically. <laughs> Wait, is this a. Okay, yeah, this is a, a skip ticket. That's what it is. And they also have auto repeat, which a lot of games should have auto repeat. Especially if you're going to have, like, the auto-wing system. Alright, let's get into it. <laughs> Just straight out one-shot her. Yeah, don't give her a chance to breathe. We aren't even giving them like the limit break and breaking her armor. It's just like straight up murdering. Uh, well then. Uh, we're not gonna talk about that. Some things happened and... Yeah. So... The anime also does that too. So, <laughs> yeah. A little etchy here and there, so I'm not going to censor it or anything. Not like I make anything off of it, you know? <laughs> Alright, next stage. So, it's actually pretty nice of them to give you that many, um, Rubies. I guess they're rubies. At the start of the game. Just because that does help you out get started like on the one of the step banners. Then all you would have to do is like do a couple of missions here and there. Then you would pretty much get another summon. Or well, your last summon off of it. Kinda curious, how much am I getting off um, each round? Or each stage? Gonna let them auto. Okay, so we do have freezing points here. It's slowly going up. Let's say it takes them forever to attack. I'm gonna just take off that and just do it myself. Oh, well then. Uh, that had to hurt. So their armor gets stripped faster with the whole rock, paper, scissor thing. And you're dead. It's funny, I've never really seen too many um, 
well, mobile games at least, go into like the etchy route. It's kind of a shock to me. Most of them wouldn't be so ballsy to go down this route. Eh, it's, it's good to see that some people are like starting to explore like different level of games. Even though PC has a lot of uh, of those etchy games. Just just saying. Just putting that out there. <laughs> All right, next battle. Well, like I said, if I can't get enough on this video, well, this first recording, I'll make a second. But like I was saying, um, if I don't get enough rubies during this, then I will pretty much put the last summoning at the end of the video. Unless they're Unless I can't figure out a way to get it. But if you don't mind a whole bunch of etchy, well, etchy as in basically people being half naked is not like on like full on porn or anything like that. I bet. If anything, if you watch Queen's Blade, it's pretty much like that. But not as bad as Queen's Blade. <laughs> this one actually has like pretty good fighting and action in it. It's not focusing solely on Echi. At least from my standpoint of watching anime. Uh, let's go back to home. Because I want to see if I'm actually getting stuff from this. Doesn't seem like it. Let me grab this. So what achievements have I not reached yet? Guessing that's gold or points or something? Uh, PvP is one of them. I do not know where PvP is. Okay, challenge mode. Uh, PvP is unlocked at level 11. Okay, noted. Oh wait, hold up. They have raids too. They have raids, they have bonus mode, they have strategy mode, and they have abyss. Those will be interesting to try out. And obviously friend list and stuff like that. Oh, whoops. I was trying to go to an event page. And now, go back. Event page. Okay, doing this gives you rewards, too. Okay. Okay, so we're almost done with the story. If anything, let's finish uh, this area and pretty much end it there. Oh, so story doesn't actually like, give you anything. Oh, it gave me 50 for getting to level 5. Okay, so every 5 levels you get like a pretty good stack of rupees. Uh, what are you making me do? Okay, bonus is unlocked. Let's see what bonus is.
I'll just forgo to next B. I can get behind go to next B. So later today, I'm supposed to be playing um, a game called um, Apparition. It's pretty much a horror game, a horror survival. It looked pretty interesting. Developers asked me to try out the game, so that's exactly what I'm going to do later on today. I might not be able to play it for like too long though. Just because I got things to do. If anything, I should have probably recorded that first before playing this, though. Eh, too late now. I'm actually having fun with this. Oh, she's the VIP out of this? Or are you just picking a character in the middle? <laughs> Wow, the, okay, the boost wasn't half bad. You might go to... Oh, no. Or, or the sandwich, that works too. Okay, so we did get another reward here. I guess this is for the bonus? Yeah, bonus dungeon. Is that a reaching level 5. Okay, so we got like 110 more to go. At least what it seems like. Oh, if we finish all these, we get this reward. That's what it is. Then the next day we get a different type of reward for finishing. Pretty straightforward. Dude, this guy has been summoning up a storm. I always see his name up there. You have to check his summonings. Probably just welling on through. You definitely say I like the um, portrait design. Alright. Oh no. Never mind. I thought he was willing, but now nah, it just shows the last message. I'm about to say, dude, give me your luck. All right. Look at her already, already laughing at me. How rude. <laughs> Take that. Now what? And to finish her off. So that's pretty nice of them to give you like a 5 star at the end of the game. Not many games do that anymore. We have a couple of games that do it now and then, but not a whole bunch of them. Pretty much a gift to get you started on the game and get you going pretty well. All right, last stage. Now after this, we're just gonna need a hundred more. So I'm guessing around level 10, I would get a hundred. Okay, that is a drill. I thought it was a lance at first. A lance would have been way better, you know. <laughs> but I guess a drill is more deadly. So I can't really blame blame her for using it. Hmm. 
I'm about to say, are you still standing? Oh, she lived. I think she was a uh, rock. That's why she lived. Oh god, it's you again. How many times are we going to fight you? Go away. I was wondering if it's like kill the boss and everybody else dies. So it's yeah, just aim for the boss and pretty much you automatically win. <laughs> Yep, I'm going back to getting five. So now that we've finished this whole chapter with like three stars, I'm pretty sure we should get like a bonus reward. No? No bonus rewards? Oh, I was about to say. Okay, we just got gold and uh, XP. Feels bad, man. All right. With that said, guys, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if I did get the summon, I will show it up at the end of this video. But until then, I will see you guys next time. I already gave you guys my opinion on the game. It's actually pretty fun and kind of interesting and very appealing to the eyes. What? Um, anywho. <laughs> I do recommend trying it out. It is on the Q app also, so you guys can download the Q app, which some people ask me how it's spelled. It's Q-O-O-A-P-P. -P. Uh, do be careful which one you download also. It's pro it should be the first one that pops up inside of Google search. So, yeah. Take that with a grain of salt, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out. All right, we're back. And I finally have enough. It only took me like three stages just to get here. We finally got enough for it. Oh, we got a purple. So I'm guessing the purple is the featured character. Okay, cool. So yellow is like rare. And purple's like epic. Did we get? Okay, so we got her. Okay. This is one of the featured units on the um, table. I've been playing this game a little bit longer. It's actually not half bad. But it does get a little bit boring after a while, though. So I'm wondering if the raids or anything are going to spice it up. And also, this whole strategy dungeon is just basically farming up material. So there's nothing really special. Oh yeah, she's definitely a main character. I remember her. So we definitely get, it, get our purple. Does it refresh? Yeah, it refreshes from the start, so you can go ahead and just do it again and step up. Yeah, that's nice. Uh, she's this one. The other two are those I didn't get. Let me go ahead and collect my stuff. Oh, geez, we got a lot of things. And it turns out these little crystal things go into like a um, rune type thing. It's, it's sort of like runes. They just place like the orbs and stuff into their back. Which I'll show you guys before I actually end off here. This right here. Leveling them up. Obviously they get new stats. 
Yeah, I forgot about this. You actually just throw these into the characters. So if I wanted to, I can give her this. And yeah, pretty straightforward. What, did we get more rewards for something? I think we did. Oh yeah, that was the gold quest. So yeah guys, that's pretty much all I wanted to show off before I actually ended it there. Just show you guys the whole little summon. Uh, I think I could do another one now. Let's do one more. Just just for good luck before we leave. Just one more. I mean, I know we're not going to get anything good, but you know, you never know. Okay, it was it was a blue. <laughs> okay, we already have her. <laughs> but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys on the next video. Until then, peace out.